Christine Dolma and uh, I'm working as a community development worker at the University Settlement. I have to think of uh, the programs that are suitable for the clients over here. We, have, we are getting uh, 30,000 clients almost uh, every year. I have to think of the programs according to their needs and also I have to look for partners and do it, go, go out and do outreach. At the moment I'm doing with the, uh, every Tuesday we are doing meeting programs, cooking class from with, uh, in partnership with the Toronto Public Health and it was very popular. Last year I started with the uh, Safe Community Initiative. We got uh, Mayor's 2009 Safety Award for this uh, program. Every day is exciting to me, so and every morning when I start I feel, hey today I'm doing this, I'm doing that, so I'm excited. Everybody says that you're so excited about your work, you're Miss Energetic. I was born in India and raised in India, but uh, in India I, I do not uh, have any status, like we are not even refugee. We, are, we, ca we cannot buy a house or we cannot uh, take a proper job because even though you are I mean, educated in India, uh, you are not uh, entitled to fight, I mean, look for the job that the normal Indians are having and so it's a problem. So he, my husband in the US, uh, he, I told him about the problem. So he told me, how about going to Canada? So I came with my six-year-old son and I told him in Canada we are going to be a citizen, we are, go we are going to belong somewhere else and then you're going to have, you know, go to a good school and you, you can do whatever you like. So when I started speaking with others, only then I realized that life is not easy in Canada. Because, of, because I do not have the Western experience, it was very, and I do not know many people, and it, it is very experienced to, even though I sent about uh, three, five jobs a day, nobody seemed to be calling me. A friend told me, you wait two years, you struggle for two years, on the third year, you will become somebody, he said. So he said that's his experience. So, so this October uh, 2010, I'm, becoming, I'm, I'm applying for the Canadian citizen. So I'm so happy, I'm thrilled. We are honored to be sponsors of the new Pioneer Award. Zering's story is truly admirable and inspirational. Her story of hard work and unrelenting dedication to building a new life in Canada and in doing so, taking the time to teach others. Well, we at CGA Ontario firmly support Skills for Change and their mission to provide learning and training opportunities for immigrants and refugees. CGA Ontario strongly supports the international community. We too envision Canada as a place where immigrants have every opportunity for success. A successful place to build a life, a family and a career. The Skills for Change, I felt that it has been the I mean, best, like uh, it really gives you the direction. I really felt very fulfilling and still I tell my friends that Go to Skills for Change, they will actually t take you from where you want to go to, the, to your destination. With this, um, I'm feeling in me, I can, I'm, I'm feeling that I, I'm, I can ov overcome any obstacles and I know I can do it. It's my pleasure to announce the recipient for the new Pioneer Skills for Change Graduate Award is Sering Dalma.